All right, YouTube, coming at you with a review that's been in the making for like eight months now. So I got the before pictures. I just have pictures of these boots when I got them uh, about eight months ago, maybe nine months ago. Um, but eight months in the construction industry, asphalt first, and then um, roofing now. Um, eight months going on, like nine months. So just those two combined have totally destroyed these boots i mean these boots are toast roofing this is definitely gonna have to get maybe some georgia boot makes some other ones uh I'll, I'll find out what the model of these is i'm sure i just punch it in or whatnot and it'll there you go uh barracuda gold wedge um, I had some other ones before this that were way nice. I got for Father's Day, and I think they were just these boots run a half size too small. So I was having problems with my feet with those. I was rubbing, and then I picked up these, but I picked up the same size. I was thinking that maybe just a different style boot. I'd have better luck, and I've had half and half luck. When my feet were really, really at their worst, were in these boots and um, I think it's just because I needed to go a size up. I've wore 10 and a half my whole life and all of a sudden I need maybe a 10 and a half wide or an 11. I'll have to look look into both to try them um, which is going to be coming up here real soon but I got the before pictures of these things. These things are are done for. I give them one thing they're super duper comfortable. Um, I beat the crap out of them. These ain't even the original laces. The original laces fell apart, ripped. These are some Walmart laces. I'm just like stitching them together, just constantly ripping. So, um, my review on these boots is: I thought they I thought they'd hold up longer. Um, I think I'm gonna give another shot to Georgia Boot. These were like 150 bucks, I think, 150 somewhere around there. And uh, I'm not ready to spend 200 bucks on a boot, but I'm also maybe look at some other boot brands and um, also might look like look at the one that I had before this in a larger size. But um, I got to say they're comfortable even when my feet hurt. My feet were like cushy in there. They were, they were rubbing and all types on the heel and stuff. But as far as the sole goes, these boots have always been super comfortable. Um, I don't know if any other boot would have held up any better or any worse in asphalt and roofing. I mean, it's just these things get beat to death day in, day out. So, uh, review on these, I'm going to go with like a 7 out of a 10. If I had to come up with a number, you know, I'd go with a 7 out of 10. I'll throw, throw the before pictures. These things were beautiful when I got them. But uh, they're that old school wedge, just regular basic construction worker looking type uh, boot. And uh, these things are close to being retired. I'm going to wear them until maybe that steel toe pops completely out or something. So maybe another month or two here, see how long they'll last. And uh, go ahead and give me some, some more work boots, some more uh, steel toe construction boots. So suggestions out there. I know everybody's got their dang suggestions. I've heard it forever the you know people's different opinion on boots but this is my experience with these georgia boots i i don't want to be unfair to them because i beat the shit out of these boots i beat them to death so uh definitely the fact that i can still wear them i think maybe might uh actually be the uh real show of toughness with these things even though they're beat to death i'm still using them Fuck. Oh, no. oh,